If we don't act now, the planet's going to be two degrees warmer by 2050. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello, what's there, crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out some Kevin Bridges. This is climate change. The last one I did was about COVID and I absolutely loved it. It was probably like the funnest video I've done all week. So you haven't checked it out, go check it out. Kevin Bridges, uh, COVID. There might be some copyright stuff on it. That's because of uh, YouTube. Uh, I have to put copyright stuff on it. If you, if you don't want to see the copyright sign, go on to Patreon. You can watch it there. Uh, yeah, let's go. We've got climate change and stuff like that. Every news story is so intense, isn't it? And it's quite hard. That's a difficult one. If you're Scottish or Irish, to really give a fuck. <laughs> I know it's a serious issue, but we're only Scottish, we're only Irish. It's quite hard to have it. It's pretty low down on a list of immediate concerns. <laughs> the planet getting warmer. <laughs> We even, we even hosted the United Nations Climate Change Conference. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It's this absolutely it's home because literally I was I was in Ireland for the weekend for Paddy's Day and my niece's birthday, and the cold difference was just something else. When I was flying down from here, I was wearing just my jumper. When I got to Ireland, I had to put my jacket on. The cold is just. Like, I grew up in Ireland. I lived in Ireland for more than fifteen years. But when I do go back, I tend to forget. The cold is just different. And I live in the, in the countryside. I live in a place called Kildare. And when it's cold, it's cold. So, <laughs> when it's chat about... Uh, the Irish people don't care about making the world... Uh, you know, the fact that it's getting warmer. They don't care. They'll be happy. Obviously, it's not good. But they don't give a fuck. Let's get back. Hey, that was held in Glasgow in November 2021. <laughs> Glasgow in November. That is a tough fucking crowd to spread alarm about the planet heating up. We, we had Greta shouting at us, how dare you? Uh, what the fuck have we done? It's fucking freezing. <laughs> if we don't act now, the planet's going to be two degrees warmer by 2050. Oh, no. <laughs> I might need to touch your vest. <laughs> I'm Scotland. We'll, we'll reap the benefits of climate change. We'll, we'll become like a resort. When the, cause, cause we love, we appreciate, we appreciate nice weather more than any country in the world. And maybe, maybe it's time to switch it up a bit. Maybe, maybe nice weather has been wasted on too many countries. Stay. You know, like, like Iraq. Let her wow. <laughs> my whole adult life, I've watched the news go live to Fallujah, and it's never a happy story. There's a big blue sky. The reporters get a wee short sleeve shirt on. He's never reporting live from a pool party. He's <laughs> never. So, Gordon, uh, back to you in the studio and getting fucking. <laughs> it's always misery. Oh, violent clashes here between Sonny and Shiites. Go on, come on, man. Religious violence. Come on, man. And that heat. It's too nice a day for that. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Leave that to Scotland and Northern Ireland, man. That sectarian <laughs> violence is a winter sport. <laughs> Why do Catholics and Protestants hate each other? Uh, because it's fucking raining. That's why. <laughs> it's fucking raining. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, this guy. I feel like I can see why he's not that popular today. Like you have to. The only reason you'd know about Kevin Bridges is if you've been a fan prior to you know the walk movement. Prior to you know 2020. 20, probably say when they would walk thing started. Probably like 2018, 2019. Prior to that. He was, he was way, he's still big now, but he's not going to be big to the new audience. Like, my little brother, he's only about 20, wait, he's 22. He'd, he'd have no clue who this geezer is. He, would, he wouldn't know who this geezer is. He'd only know, you know, the latest comedians that, you know, that are very woke, you know, that kind of stuff. I'm not saying it's bad being woke, but so some things that I just don't agree with too. And we can talk about that later. But yeah, uh, I love this geezer. I love Kevin Bridges. I just hope he just keeps continuing. And I would love to go see him live. When I do go see him, any comedian live again i'll do like a little vlog for you guys it'd be so good i'll do a day in their life i actually just bought a new camera 
Yeah, let me know if you guys know uh this camera. DJI Osmo Pocket 3. <sighs> to light speed portable camera, it cost a lot. It cost me six hundred and twenty pounds. Yes, a lot. But I have plans to, you know, do more live food reactions with you guys. Not just live. I'm I'll do I'll be doing a lot of food reactions. I'm gonna be doing reactions to Iron Brew, the drink, so that camera will come in handy. Uh, and for my other food, I have a football channel, in case you don't know. Eddie Vlogs Football. That's where I do, you know, stadium tours, Birmingham City, City uh, match days, you know, things like that. I love football, so that's my second channel. And yeah, if you guys want to see more stuff, subscribe to that channel. Let me know what food you would like me to try. If it's a British food, an Irish food, English food, that I probably haven't tried. I'm the kind of person that I stick to what I know. My breakfast every day is toast, baked beans, and cheese. That's what I have. Almost every single day. If I don't have that, I probably have a crunchy nut. So there's a lot of food I haven't tried yet in England. So if there's a Scottish food or an English food, and you feel like, Eddie, I like this food, or I like this snack, type in that below. Or a drink that's not that popular. If you feel like, Eddie, give it a try. I would love to give it a try. That would literally mean the world to me. So yeah, don't be shy. Comment down below. And uh, I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.